Welcome to this episode of Brewers with Brewnats. My name's Ryan. I'm Jake, and I don't know where I am. We're the Knights of the Brew Table! Woo! Today on Brewers with Brewnats, we're going to be trying Angry Orchard Stone Dry. Tell me a little bit more about that, Jake, besides the fact that it's 5.5% ABV. I'm going to read the bottle here. Our twist on traditional English ciders. Stone Dry balances the acidity of culinary... Culinary. Culinary. Not culinary. <laughs> culinary apples with the tannins and the dryness of bitter sweet apples. The result is a refreshing, slightly puckering cider, almost as dry as a stone. What do we got? It's got a, a rather <coughs> gentle smell, huh? Oh man, that's the way a cider should smell, man. No, really, yeah, it smells like a uh, it smells like a regular Angry Orchard if they turned down the sweetness a little bit. A lot. A lot. So yeah, that smells pretty good. Let's go ahead and try it. Let's give it a sip, eh? Dude, that's awesome. That's kind of what I was expecting, really. That's what I was hoping for, really. The hot mat apple, a little more sweet than this. Yes. And I just, when, when it comes to ciders, I really would rather them be drier, and not as sweet. There's nothing quite like this on the market. This is definitely a drier. This is like a beer that they decided to have the apples in as an afterthought. For this you. is like a dry apple wine of sorts. Because like it almost has that feature to where your mouth dries out a little bit, like tannins. Right. Um, but it's still carbonated, like effervescent almost. It's like, it feels like it's less carbonated too. Like it's almost effervescent, like a, like a champagne, or like a Moscow de Asti or something like that. Is that what that is? Hot mad apple's really good too, but this is just, this is the way I would want to drink a, a hard cider, in my opinion. It's just not sweet at all, really. It's absolutely refreshing, really. Yeah. Uh, well, Jake, why don't you start reading scale here? This one is really damn good. I'm gonna give this one a four. Yeah, it's certainly what I was looking for exactly in an apple cider. I mean, honestly, um, I'm gonna disagree with you. This is perfect to me, as far as the cider goes. I'm gonna give it a five. Cider wise, like this, it's more. It's almost like a beer, and that's. But it's you can still get that apple flavor. It's phenomenal. Really is in my eyes. If you like, if you don't like the sweetness, you get in like um, mainstream ciders. This is the way to go. Like literally, like like a two out of ten in sweetness. Nice and dry, still apple-y. I love it. Well, thank you for watching this episode of Brews of the Brew Nights. My name's Ryan. I've been Jake. We're the Knights of the Brew Table. Woohoo! You guys have a wonderful day! Thank you for watching.